once upon a goat. Once Upon a Goat by Dan Richards, pictures by Eric Barclay. Once upon a time, in a faraway kingdom, a queen and king wished for a child. Yes, but where would we put it? asked the king. Next to the vase on the hearth, naturally, replied the queen. Or beside the roses in the garden, the king added. Oh yes, perfect, agreed the queen. One day, their fairy godmother stopped by for a visit. Tell me what you desire, she asked. We'd like to start a family, said the king. Not particular, said the queen. Glowing skin, bright eyes, and hair like ocean waves should do. Hmm, said the fairy godmother. A boy would be great, added the king. But any kid will do. Of course, answered the fairy godmother. Look on your doorstep. When the moon is full. At the next full moon, the king and queen ran to the door. Let it be a boy, said the king. With hair like ocean waves, said the queen. I wanted a baby, cried the queen. It's my fault, wailed the king. I said any kid would do, but I never meant this. Reluctantly, the king and queen brought the little beast into their home. Look on the bright side, said the king. We can still hold it like a baby. It has a goatee, replied the queen. We won't need to change its diapers, said the queen. That's disgusting, replied the king. At least it loves royal roses, said the king. That's it. It has to go, commanded the queen. I guess we're better off now, said the queen sadly. A stand had to be taken for the roses, replied the king. Of course, said the queen. That night, it rained hard. It's not our fault we're given a coat, said the queen. Not our fault at all, said the king. And yet, I wonder if we're right to send the little fellow away such a blistery night. Clearly, he lacks good sense to find shelter. I suppose he could come in just for a bit to dry off. 
He looks hungry, said the king. Maybe he could share a nipple or two from our meal. It's late. We can hardly send him away now, said the queen. She shall have to, he shall have to stay in our room for the night. It's only for the night, said the king. One night turned into weeks and weeks into months. Before long, their fairy godmother returned for a visit. How is everything? Wonderful, replied the king and queen. Perfect. May I see the child? Isn't he darling, said the king. A blessing, added the queen. You must be joking, said their fairy godmother. It's a goat. Yes, left on the doorstep when the, the moon was full, just like you said. Uh-oh, said their fairy godmother. I'll be right back. Oh dear, this is for the best, really. My sincere apologies for the misunderstanding. I'll just return the goat and that'll be that. Wait, said the queen. Perhaps there's an alternative, said the king at last. Yes, I see your point, said their fairy godmother. And they lived happily ever after the end.